Welcome back to my channel. This is me, Del Nadum. Here I am today to speak out on behalf of all those unheard voices of students and parents who are under extreme pressure of paying high skyrocketing fees. We are in season of ongoing pandemic and have been under complete lockdown for the past six months, leading to the economic slowdown all across the country. I remember it was on 20 March 2020, I booked my flight ticket and hurried back to my state or natural place. Our country underwent complete lockdown from 25th March 2020. It was a time when school students were appearing their exam, particularly to mention of class 10 and 12 CBSC board. Colleges and universities were in mid of their semesters. Since then, the classes are conducted online and we have appeared our exam in online mode. Now, the new semester is starting again and the institutions are charging the same skyrocketing fees from the student. Uh, schools, university and college are set, classes are conducted online and we are all back in our own respective homes. Then why are they charging such a huge amount? I wonder why we need to pay hostel charges, transportation charges, lavatory charges and miscellaneous. Gaining education should not be hindered of inability of paying such fees. The national population of India is so large that almost half of the total population depend on private sectors or on daily wages. Ongoing pandemic has affected many lives. Many of our parents have lost their job, downfall in business sectors and negligible sources of income. Many are struggling to get two square meal a day. Under such trying and testing condition, it is the moral duty of every citizen and institutions to respond positively to the best of their ability to empower and support one another. They say students are the fillers of the nation. Will we students be supported to uphold this saying or will it just remain in a word? The primary responsibility of an institution is to educate students. So it's high time for an institution to help out the youngsters and their families by charging basic and reasonable fees. So that we students and family have to look back and feel appreciation for everything. It's my humble appeal to all the higher authorities, that is, principal, HODs, vice chancellor, and educational ministers of concerned institution of various state of our country to look into the matter at earliest. We students and parents are looking forward for your positive response. Thank you.